Hi everyone and welcome back to Three Ways to Play Hitman 2. Today we're taking on the mission Another Life, set here in the lovely suburbs of Whittleton Creek, and our task is to eliminate the Constant, who's an old dude who also goes by Janus, as well as his right-hand man Nolan Cassidy. Also while we're here, Diana wants us to go get some intel, because probably if you don't give 47 enough to do, he just starts killing people at random or something. Anyway, off we go. What a lovely suburb this is. Welcome back, Hitman fans. Welcome to Whittleton Creek. I've got two targets and a whole bunch of intel, so let's get this show on the road. <laughs> okay, let me explain for a minute. Uh, obviously, this level is somewhat inspired by a level from Blood Money called A New Life, and that is where the famous clown outfit came from. So I thought it would only be appropriate to dress as a clown for this next hit. All right, time to stride purposefully around Whittleson Creek. Nice suburb. I've been getting a lot of flack lately for not doing good enough assassinations and playing on casual accidentally. So I really feel like this is the, this is the Hitman mission where I'm going to redeem myself uh, and reclaim my title of Top Hitman. So... What have we got here? Exterminator. That sounds good. That sounds like something I can work with. Hello. What's all this pinkness about then? It appears to be a, wait for it, muffin stand. Amazing. I was supposed to meet a client for a house showing today, but I can't stop eating. Just your friendly local neighborhood muffin stand. And this dude is a... A realtor with a taste for the sweet things in life is in Whittleton. A realtor, or an estate agent, as we know them in the UK. He is selling a house to one of my targets, which is super convenient. Right, he's mad for the muffins, and I figure I need to become him to show my target around that house. I didn't bring any poison because I'm an idiot, all right? Um, but yeah, let's make that priority one, finding some poison of some kind. I'm gonna take this muffin with me. Maybe I can poison it somewhere and then, you know, bring it back and pop it on a serving tray. Oh, can I ride on the little racing car? Please, if you haven't put an animation in for this IO. Oh, I'm so upset. Oh, it moves at least, but I, w I wanna ride it. Oh man. Right, off we go. Continuing our tour of the suburban neighbourhood of Whistleton Creek. Hopefully to find some poison. Okay, these guys... Are they the ex they're not the exterminators. Chemicals, okay. Alright, sleeping agent. Okay, this sounds like something I can work with. Okay, it's a big operation, this pink muffin company. Every time he sees out and wants to talk. Every, literally everyone on the street is revealing mission critical details in like noisy conversations. This is brilliant. What do we got? What do you say? Newspaper? Can't kill someone with a roll. What am I saying? Of course I can kill someone with a rolled up newspaper. Look at me. Yeah, old Jason Bourne on you. Right, we've got a humane exterminator, which is less deadly than I would like. But maybe if I can knock out the target, it'll knock out all his guards and then I can just kill the target. That sounds... Pretty good. Oh boy. Wow, I'm getting real deja vu from this whole scenario. Oh, and the old garbage truck here. And they are chatting about this guy. Who is Oh Ah That's not that's not any random bench sitter, that's a a security dude from my target's security detail. He's probably useful. And he is reading intel that I require. Because, yeah, I've not only got two targets to eliminate. I've got to collect a whole bunch of intel, and it's non-optional. So, good times. Unless it's a flesh-eating mutant mole, you don't need explosives. Explosives, you say? I think I just saw a flicker of excitement cross Agent 47's face. Okay, well, those guys didn't tell me where the poison is. But he said something about the green shed, which I assume is around here somewhere. I mean, this is green. Not, no, not in the toilet, 47. I guess just uh, choke him out with a newspaper? Is that a thing? Donk him over the head with a rolled up newspaper? No, 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 just, just your classic subduing. Non-lethal subduing, nice and professional. 
Let's get him uh, tucked away before the before the sanitation workers come back. God damn it! <laughs> so this policeman's confiscated this guy's explosives. Where's this guy going to? Is he going to go and loudly explain where the explosives are? Because that would be really useful. So in here, I guess. Good thing I've got this lock pick. Again, top hitman skills going on here. Reclaiming my title, everyone, and just pay attention. Uh, ah, there we go. What's that? Insecticide. Great. Okay. Insecticide. Now what? I guess. I guess I need to dress up as an exterminator. Real profesh, like get him in the long reeds, out of public view, and then no one will be any the wiser, and I get his book. There you go. Perfect. Look at him. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, he slid. He slid, Diana! You saw it! He slid! That's... How is that on me? He slid. That's... If anyone's to blame, it's him. I'm sorry, sir. I can't let you through, okay? That's fine. That's fine, because I'll literally just walk round here? I mean, come on. Okay, so I need to dress up as an exterminator. Otherwise, no one is going to let me uh, spray insecticide all over their house. I assume. So, probably over back by the van, I guess? Right. Well, with that little hiccup uh, behind us, let's forge bravely ahead and uh, eavesdrop on this conversation. Weeks ago, I walked past him and I have to tell you, he gets into some pretty personal stuff. Oh, okay. So this is another member of Janice's staff. Janus has an appointment with a male nurse every Saturday. It's a male nurse, also known as a nurse. And he's down feeding the birds by the creek right now. Is he putting the explosives in the box? Yes. Yes. Maybe someone, he left a spare set of exterminator's clothes in the van. Uh, or what have we got? Oh. Okay, didn't see there, buddy. This is good. This is better than a spare set of clothes. Uh, that's a nurse if ever I saw one. Look at those scrubs. That's going to be a real useful disguise at some point and if i'm gonna get hold of it i need this this guy to isolate himself and oh okay he's uh he doesn't like his boss very much but hey who does mm. amazing he's left the fumigation thing set up at one of our target's houses. Perfect. All right, so all I need to do now is just knock him out. And then I can take the uh, the outfit, go over there and rig up this insecticide. Cool. All right, this is a good place to stash a body, unconscious or unliving. So all I need is to get this fella alone and unobserved. But there's people everywhere. Oh, oh. Hang on. Maybe he'll be... How does he feel about bike bells? Curious? Interested? How interested? Who's going to come and check it out? Not this guy. Aha! Yes, perfect. You'll be sorry. You'll be sorry you were curious about that bike bell. Okay. Now's my chance. Give... Oh, okay. Got him. Got him, got him, got him. Right. Perfect. Save that for later. Oh, we got a jogger. We got a jogger. Just keep jogging. Oh my god, lady. Your lack of cardiovascular fitness is ruining my plan. Get out of here. Yeah, right. Now, now, now. No one look at me. Good. And then I'm just going to pop you in this bush. And then you'll wake up refreshed uh, and surrounded by nature. And it'll be really, um, yeah, soothing and relaxing. And yes, you're welcome. You should be thanking me, really. You'll be sorry when you wake up in this shed. All right. And I, uh, I, I'm gonna go for the not Janus target first because I feel like Janus is the bigger, more difficult target. I want to warm up with the easier, uh, the easier target first. So I'm gonna leave the male nurse there. But everyone, everyone, remember where I parked the male nurse. I'm out of here. Okay. Oh, I'll put that. There we go. 
Right. I think I should probably deal with Nolan Cassidy first, because much as it's tempting to bump off the old man, um, I think actually... I should get rid of his security detail first, let's say. All right, I've wandered around a bit, and I, I don't know for sure, but I'm guessing it's probably this house, considering how heavily guarded it is. Oh, hang on, hang on. While I'm, while I'm here, who doesn't need a crowbar? So that's going to be really useful. Oh, there's Nolan Cassidy just wandering around, like he's not the target of an international hit. All right, I'm heading in. I don't think the target's here, but if it's his house, he might come back, I guess. I don't know, I'm kind of flying blind here, but uh, let's see how we get on. Another shed. See, crowbar. Gotta have a crowbar. And uh, this shed, meanwhile, has a microwave washing machine, soda can, a whole bunch of junk. Anything useful though? Oh, Intel. No, Intel? Janus is Question mark? In a mm, law document, legal documents, but not, not nothing really juicy. Wants Janus to stop his annual landing of a helicopter. Mm, 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 just you know, neighbour drama. Oh, oh, uh, I think I'm being, I'm being rumbled. Oh no, I'm being rumbled. I'm, be I've been rumbled, and this guy, yeah, he's a. Uh, Ooh, he snuck right up on me. Hey, well, and now he's unconscious, so uh, no harm, no foul. Let's get you inside your your junk shed. And uh, who knows, maybe maybe this disguise will come in useful later. Everyone remember where I parked the troublesome neighbour. How about we follow him, see where he goes? Every so often I forget that I'm a clown, <laughs> and then I remember and everything's right in the world. Oh, oh, hello. Well, that was easy. <laughs> I thought I'd have to make my way through the house, but it's right here, it's outside, of course it is. Okay, so let's pop the insecticide in. Yeah. Okay, security camera. But, proof I'm playing unprofessional. How about that? Yeah, no, I know, yes, thank you. That's enough proof now that I'm playing unprofessional. Okay, right. Ah, here he comes. Excellent. Wait, wait. Hang on. Yes. Yes. Perfect. I found the rat poison. You'd have thought some sort of security expert would by now have A, noticed the clown following him around and B, gotten suspicious about the clown following him around. Okay. Diana, here's the plan. Get crouchy. And observe... I need to, before I can just plant a poisoned muffin, I need to become a, you know, one of these muffin servers. So if I, um, distract everyone, everyone with a superior performance coin or whatever it's called. Yes. If everyone just would kindly look away for a moment, I can sneak up on this muffin employee. Okay, here we go. Insecticide. Wow, that was a lot of breaking glass. Oh, barbecue. You need a clown for the barbecue? Oh, he's got a little mini golf course as well. Oh, forget the hit. Let's play drunken mini golf. And there we go. <laughs> I'm just going to pop back up from behind the table looking completely different. And no one will be any the wiser. Hang on, let me get this on real quick. Real quick, 47. And fresh disguise. Back we go. Stand up straight. Guy turns around. And I look completely different, but he's none the wiser. And what? Nothing. It's fine. This is how I always looked. Hi. Uh, whatever. Get, are they going to mind if I poison it right in front of them? Nah. It's extra flavour. It's just, just vanilla extract. There you go. Delicious vanilla. Just a drop, just a touch of it. And now it's perfect and ready. Please enjoy. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. Mmm, sure was a meatic, all that vanilla. Take a spare muffin. You never know, might need another one. Might get hungry. Don't want low blood sugar, Diana. You know how I get. Real cranky. Crankier. 
There he is. It's that fast acting vanilla. And now he needs to go. Oh, I, I don't know. I don't know where he's going to go. Into a house? Selfie. I mean, really, hitmen probably shouldn't be taking selfies, but... Am I okay going in here? I've got a mask on, right? Yeah, that's what I thought. All right, good. Okay, so he's unconscious. Everyone's unconscious. No one saw each other go unconscious. So I haven't got any bodies found. That's good. Oh, a trash can! I see. There we go. Oh, that was a long way to come and get choked out, wasn't it? Never mind, eh? Let's get your realtor clothes on. Uh, yeah, everyone's out. Everyone is out. This is good. So I've got a feeling I need to get this barbecue started. Yeah. So if I can just pass myself off as a clown slash propane delivery man, um, this plan might work. Right. So, Mr. Cassidy, come on out. I haven't got all day. I need to show you this house and also kill you in this house. I expect. I hope this um I hope this house that I'm I'm meant to be showing him around with a view to buying it is full of really lethal things. If it's just an empty house, well I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'll figure something out. Probably just just choke him out and snap his neck. That always seems to work. Not as exciting. Not as thematic. Right. Now I'm right here. Mr. Cassidy. There we go. Oh, that's triggered it. There we go. About time. Let's go. Ah, perfect. Propane flask. That's what we need. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Which window did I climb through? Which window did I terrifyingly climb through? Hmm. A recording of some sort. The note mentions another house. Perhaps Cassidy is using one of the vacant buildings as a base of operations, 47. Well, okay, yeah, maybe, but he's also here, unconscious. So why don't I just snap his neck? How about that, Diana? Good, okay, we both had good plans, Diana. But I think mine was a little quicker. Let's get this food on. Hi, you could just uh, whatever. Oh. Wow, you look at that. It's good to know the kind that help people still. Yes, yes, and some of them are dressed like clowns. It's got some, uh, got some snacks, a little buffet. Oh, I can, um, oh, I, oh, I don't have any more poison. I do have this fish. Does that help? What? <laughs> it became sushi. <laughs> you put fish on a plate, it becomes, just becomes a nice bit of sushi. But I don't have any poison. So, to what end, really, 47? What was the point of that spontaneous sushi? This is the downstairs living room. Hmm? It is most commonly used for <laughs> watching television and other recreational purposes. Really selling it there. Oh, oh, hang on. His bodyguard is, uh... Hey, you know how to eat... Oh, he's eating my sushi. It's not even poisoned. What a waste. Well, there goes my fish, I suppose. Right. Moving along. Um... Basement, basement. That's like the most murdery room in a house, right? Let's uh, push him down the stairs. Maybe he'll break something. Or not? Nope. Uh, follow me right this way. I obviously am very familiar with the layout of this house. There's a chest freezer and a very dark, very spooky basement. Got a oh, hang on. Maybe I can separate him from his bodyguard if I overflow this sink. How about that? Right. I just need to separate them in this murder basement. It's very sinister. If I bring him over here, maybe I can show him show him this chest freezer as part of the tour. Great. Okay. He is down. Now. Now. Now for the, J uh, the Janus guy, the constant, but also... Erase the tapes. There we go. It's like I was never here, except for all these unconscious bodies. Okay. Let me see if I can find a server's outfit, because, quite frankly, that guy's not going anywhere near the buffet. Well, well. And Let me tell you all about... <laughs> the real centrepiece of this home, obviously, is the dark basement. 
Now that is more like it. That looks just like a vault. Oh! What? Oh, yeah, 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 obviously, of course, yes, there is a safe room. I mean, that's, that's the whole point. Where did the bodyguard go? Did the, did the bodyguard just, just take a break or something? Where did he go? Never mind, never mind. Focus up, 47. Um, let's show, no one Cassidy, the, what is it? It's a safe room, it's full of lasers, full of deadly lasers, you know. Kronstadt Matrix Laser Home Security. Oh, it's like the sort of foyer to a panic room, I, I think. The thing about these systems is most homeowners are lazy. So And now Mr. Cassidy he is uh finagling the, the laser grid. Good, good. This all appears to be going to plan. I assume. I assume this is all this is all going to plan 47. Like Schmidt was a bigger amateur than I imagined. Okay. So the previous homeowner, I don't know, didn't change the password, you know, one, two, three, four. And now I can, oh, turn it back on. No, don't turn it back on. Yes. Oh, oh, wow. Okay. That escalated. Why were there explosives? Just, uh, okay. I guess that was the defensive laser grid for the panic room. And now, and now my target is no more. And his bodyguard is going to be real embarrassed when he gets back off his coffee break or wherever he went. Cool. What's through here? Oh, it's like a dog room. Oh, hello. Oh, hi. I'm on my way out. Bye. Hmm. Does that count as a server's outfit? Probably. Let's give it a whirl. Yeah, server. I mean, it says muffins, but that's fine. That's absolutely fine. A bit worried that if people see all these unconscious guys and one dead guy with a broken neck, they're going to get suspicious. So I'm just going to mock up a little little crime scene, make it look like an accident, um, just so people don't get suspicious, don't get people snooping around. So what I thought was, because he's got a broken neck, I will just um, pop him out one of the upstairs windows, make it look like a fall, uh, make it look like he had an accident, like he was overcome with gas and he sort of stumbled backwards out of a window. So I'm just going to go and find an upstairs window to uh, to pop him out of. Just, you know, make everything seem all uh, nice and accidental. The room looks like it's outfitted with a lot of security and a lot It's outfitted with a window, Diana. That's all that I care about at the moment. Nope. Nope, one of those non-interactive windows, is it? All right, fine, there's gonna be more windows around here. Okay, here we go. Oh, I can poison it as well. Yes, emetic rat poison, get in there. Just a little garnish. Adds to the flavor, I'm sure. Let's pop you in the, pop you in the freezer. And no one will be any the wiser. You just disappeared one day. Okay, buddy, your turn. Come on over. Uh, there's an open spot. So, what's good here? I hear it's all to die for. Ah, uh, 47 with the quips. All right. Please s step right up. Yeah, you do that. Enjoy. Okay, if I... How, how can I get an angle on the... All right, here we go. I'm going to give it a whirl. Oh boy, everyone's suspicious. Is he dead? He's not even dead. He's knocked out. Oh no. Oh, I need my clown outfit back. Okay, how about this one? This looks fine. Not too wide of a ledge. You could easily get him out of that window, 47, easily. Nope. Nope. All right, fine. Oh boy. Uh, a quick outfit change required. Um... Okay, close that. This guy's clown suit. Clown suit. Oh, I'm out of combat. Perfect. Okay, but he's not dead. He's only knocked out. This has gone badly, badly wrong. Sweet. Well, that's target one. Done and done. And I no longer need to be dressed as a real estate agent, thank goodness. So off I go back to shed the first. All right, I need to find a way to shoot that guy. Ah, oh, the treehouse, treehouse, right. Okay. If I hop over here, 
maybe I can get an angle from the treehouse and shoot him in the head. Where is he? Okay. Gun out. Yes. Yes, perfect. That's his, that's his head, isn't it? There we go. This one for sure. Oh, come on, 47. It's like you don't want to pull off the perfect crime. All right, fine. Got another idea? Target eliminated. Oh my god, I can't believe that worked. That was incredible. Slide down. Oh no, I'm in combat. Oh, the clown has been rumbled. Ah. Oh boy. Oh boy. I cannot believe that worked though. Long range treehouse snipe to unconscious man slumped by barbecue is what the headlines will read. Return to the scene of a crime and get in the shed, dress up as a nurse, and then we'll see what's what about the second target. Right, instead, I pop him over the balcony. Then uh, it'll look like he got a snoot full of gas, fell over backwards off the balcony, and... Ooh, yeah, that's the stuff. That'll do it. That will definitely do it. So yeah, when you when the investigators come in, they'll be like, "Oh, he was clearly stood at the top of the balcony. The act, the gas accident happened. He fell unconscious, tripped backwards over the banister, broke his neck. Accident, total accident. Could have happened to anyone. All right, perfect crime achieved. Uh, time to get out of here and uh, get on to our next target. All right, I really need a better disguise. Uh, literally any disguise will do. <laughs> Okay, I'm just going to hide in these bushes and, and regroup a bit. No, 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 quick, covered, covered. Oh my god, I'm going to have to knock this guy out with a shovel. I wonder how much he remembers, how little he cares. Not as little as I care. Do, oh. Uh oh no, no that's not that's not the bathroom. I knew that. Just checking, just checking to see whether you knew that that wasn't the bathroom. That was uh, that was the first stage of the of the checkup, sir. 